everyone welcome back to my channel it is day three in the new house uh, work from home day so nothing exciting planned for today um, we're still figuring out what we want to do tonight whether it's uh, walking around the resort and figuring out what all there is to do like volleyball courts and walking pads and the clubhouse so uh, we may do that for a little bit we may go to the outlets but for right now the two of us are just working getting work done I work until 4 30 so um, that fills up the day a little bit which is it's a good thing but also it's kind of hard to focus when I'm in Florida on vacation but that's okay such as COVID and life but that's cool um, I'm doing a few things to the house today I already switched out the new shower curtain uh, that is from Redbubble I will put that in the description if you want to check that out <laughs> a couple pieces of furniture I don't know if I'll film that because it'll take two people two hands who knows where my phone will go but that's okay uh, you'll see updates of that in future visits I'm going to flip the bedspread in the girls bedroom because we saw that it was a more neutral flower on the other side as opposed to uh, a big Anna and Elsa which we like the flowers better <laughs> And finally, I am throwing away the dreaded plush. After checking out the house, I noticed there was a lot more Simpsons characters than there should be. They're really creepy. It's a creepy clown. I don't want to sleep on a bed with a creepy clown, and I can't imagine other people do too. So I'm going to throw all of those away. I'm so very excited. Even Olaf. Olaf is gross. I'm not going to detail that, but if... If you're bringing kids on vacation, they're going to either buy plush while they're here or bring their own. So those are going in their trash. So um, we'll see what else is planned for today. I will keep you guys posted, but... That's where we're at right now, so I will keep you updated. So clearly I'm not back at the house anymore. Surprise! We came back to Disney property. We are at the Animal Kingdom Lodge Kidani Village to eat an appetizer at Sanaa before we have dinner back at the house. Uh, we didn't want to be trapped inside all day, so this is the closest via Uber and or Lyft. So here's where we are. So I will keep you updated as we look around. We looked at the animals a little bit. So now we're just in the lounge area um, doing a first course before dinner. So I will take you guys back. So Morgan heard Halloween merch, and now we're going back to Disney Springs. <laughs> Should we be surprised? No. 2,000 years later. Helpful hint, in this corona-ridden world, with all of the resorts not open, buses take a crap ton of time. We've been sitting here for about 20 minutes, and a Disney Springs bus has not come. So if you are resort hopping or going to Springs, pick a resort with guests staying at it. You will save so much time. All right, hopefully you can hear me, but this is World of Disney. We literally came back just to see the Halloween merch. When we came yesterday, there was a line uh, back there by Stitch. It was wrapped all the way around the back. But today, they're letting us walk right through that door there. So, it's definitely far less busy. Granted, it is a Monday night. Um, I'd hoped it would be less busy, but with dropping of new merch, you never know if people are gonna wanna come after work and come check it out. So, I am pleasantly surprised even more so tonight versus yesterday. So uh, I guess the weekdays are the times to be here. So 
if you're thinking about coming, weeknights are, are it. And we're about to head in, so let's go. Okay, so story time. Back at the house, finished at Springs. Morgan and I pick up an Uber so that we can get back home. And as we're in the car, I realize, oh, we fly out at six o'clock tomorrow morning. I didn't check in for our flights because obviously you check in 24 hours before you fly. But I realized I never got an email about it, which was really strange. So I go to check the app and my heart drops because the app says we're flying on Wednesday. Well, tomorrow's Tuesday. And so I stared at it and I kept checking it. I'm like, wait a second, this can't be right. I booked for Tuesday, not Wednesday. And sure enough, it wouldn't give me the ability to check in because it says we fly out Wednesday. I literally booked a flight the day after I thought. So I, there was a lot of confusion with Morgan and I on deciding when we were coming and going because flights were the same price and we both work remote. And so it really didn't matter either way, but we're like, let's just make it a short trip. We'll come home on Tuesday. Well, surprise, we come home on Wednesday. So that was a fun little thing. And it's just really weird for me because usually picking the wrong day of a flight would be a big deal, whether it's hotel or food or work. There's always factors that play into it, but with COVID and working remotely, there's literally no problem with us staying an extra day. So I'm trying to wrap my head around the fact that there's, there's no problem. So if you can explain that to me, let me know in the comments. Has it ever happened to anyone else that you booked the wrong flight or anything similar? Let me know so I can feel a little bit better about it. But that's where I'm gonna wrap up tonight. Um, you saw a little bit of the changes of the house. Uh, we did Springs and Animal Kingdom Lodge. Uh, Really good time. The only drawback I thought for today was how slow the bus was from Animal Kingdom Lodge to Springs, but that really didn't impact any of our day. So tomorrow is obviously gonna be now a work from home day, work from vacation home day, not a work from home home like I was anticipating. So that's cool. So come back next week and you can see the house. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked my clickbaity booking the wrong flight. And if you liked seeing around Disney Springs and a few other things, um, if you want to check out future videos, go ahead and subscribe. I appreciate it. I love you guys. Thanks for watching and I will see you soon. Bye.